The European Cricket League is proudly brought to you by Dream 11, HCL Software, La Junta de Andalucía, Paramatch and Norcane. And the official charity partner, Share the Meal by the United Nations World Food Programme. Here we go. All right. Game on is Bubba facing up. First one is just off the thigh pad. I think it'll be four leg buys. I guess it's an unhit four. Probably slightly misdirected by Irfan first up in the first runs of this contest. Pitched up and whipped away nicely by Bubba. And with the pace of Irfan, that's going to race away for the first hit boundary of match four. Oh, edged, and that one almost edged down, wasn't it? And doesn't carry through to the keeper. A high-risk shot, because that third man is just in that perfect spot for a sort of yeah. rundown. You can, yeah, you can't get too funky with this cut, with the third so fine. Full one first up, square driven, and that'll be four. So, not the greatest start from Harry Hankin. All right, well, oh. that's more like it from Baba, who just clips this one away effortlessly. Maximo! First one of the game. All right, similar, and this one is coming our way. Maximo! That's a similar kind of ball, similar kind of length. Just probably too straight to Baba. Now, it goes up over the offside. Now, this one's going to sail as well into Cockney Corner. Well, heads up. Maximo! Uno, dos, tres... That guy here flying away in the second. Anyway, this is whipped away nicely and Baba wins this battle. He's just got that whip going. <laughs> oh, it goes glove or to bat to helmet. Pops up. Irfan gets it in the follow through. Well, they might have to do a concussion test because the, it's actually gone up into the helmet. It's hit the bat. He does, but Baba is kind of one step ahead there, isn't he? He was expecting it short, and it is pulled away behind square. Cuatro Carreras. He goes forward, and he gets the ball he wants. Maximo. Kind of challenge length from Adil Malik, really. He does run at this, and drills it towards the field. But it gets away from George Hankins. That'll be four. I have to say, with their high standards, they'll be disappointed they're not able to keep that ball in the field of play. Now, Shot. it's going to be cut away, and that's going to be four as well. Daniel Dorkaya winning this battle as that over goes for 16. 50's come up during the over as well. Yeah. Ooh, pretty close. He's gone. Well, Stefan Gooch wastes no time. Lesborn does what his compatriots couldn't. He removes Baba from the equation. It was pretty full. Tried to go for his favourite little clip. But that's the risk, isn't it? Hitting across the line. Pakai Care lose there first. It's 57 for one. Yeah, good bowling. Full and straight. Baba usually loves to play that clip shot over the leg side, but played across this one. And the first wicket will go. Easy decision for Stefan Gooch, the umpire. Angled in, hitting him basically halfway up. And that was cannoning into the stumps. You've seen lefty faces up to him. Now that's a big hanging full toss and he pounds it through the offside for four. A nice way to start his account for championship week. This time he's sweating on the short one, but he's holed out and it's Griffiths that takes the catch. So Yassine goes on the pull and Edwards has two in the fifth over. Pakai Kerr, 61 for two. Pitched up, Shot. hit really hard, and that is going to beat the field of four runs. Just a classical straight drive, good old-fashioned half volley, put away by Mohamed Isan. That one is in at their legs, and he's oh. so quick to get through that. Crossbar challenge complete. They're dismantling the studio to move it to the other side. All right, this one has been hit, but it's hit straight to the fielder. Once again, perfectly placed. George Hankins takes the catch. So Ishan goes 4-6 and out. Griffiths has a wicket now in the sixth over. Pakai Care, 74 for three. Yeah, that's two now. Yassine and Ishan both hitting very flat balls and well caught on the boundary rope. That's uh, Hankins this time. Ishan not getting the elevation. It would have been six, but if you pick the fielder out, it's going to cost you your wicket. Oh, he could be gone first ball. He is. He stepped right across. I think it gets him in front of. Middle and off, and I couldn't see it missing, so it's going to be a golden duck. Sakanda tries to funkify his innings before it's even begun, and suddenly 
Griffiths is on a hat trick and it's 74 for four. Hat trick ball. Yeah, hat trick ball coming up. Sebastian Brutt faces up. He's a little bit careful. Or oh, might be a run out though. Oh, and he would have been gone too. Had to throw from a real awkward position. Now it goes up in the air. Hankin takes another catch. They have been on fire in the field today, Hornchurch. He takes that one in front of Cockney Corner that goes wild behind him. Daniel Dog Kayet could never get into his innings today. He goes for 22 and it's 76 for five. Yeah. Not a bad shot. He's going to take on the fielder and win. Maximo. Watch out for that. That's out. Yep, adios. And Mochim got away with the first one, doesn't get away with the second. Griffiths goes full at the stumps. A pretty good strategy uh, against the middle and lower order. And so Packer can lose another one playing across the line. It's 83 for six. Anyway, this is in the air and it could be another one. It should be and it will be. So very professional again. A team's going to have to go. He kind of went for a more aggressive option. So he'll go for just a single. And Griffiths has four in match four as Pakai Care, 85 <laughs> for 7. And there's the chairman of the board, Jeremy. He's having a very, very good time so far with his team well on top in this contest. Coming back in the ninth. And he has go at it. And it's going to be dropped for six. Maximo. Anyway, six handy runs. Now it goes again, but no one's catching this. Maximo. Can see the frustration on Griffith's face there at deep mid wicket because he knows at least he should have been able to keep that last one in the boundary. Next one disappears. Wow, he just horns this in the air. Guess who? It's Griffiths again. More easy this time for the big man. He takes the cat. So Brat does a bit of fancy footwork. Puts the bat through it. Doesn't really get the distance. Gets the height as Gavin comes good. Later in the over. He costs him 12, but in the end it is 8 down. It's 99 for 8. Well, in the air, and as the rooster crows, another one goes. This time it's VJ that takes the catch. It's all the nines, the emergency line, 99 for nine. Rabani, a three-ball duck. As Pakai Care are one wicket away from demolition. And the chairman of the board, well, he's loving what he's seeing from his Hornchurch players. Yep, 99 for nine on 100. Now in the air. Well, they'll get at least six more as that one disappears into Cockney Corner. Maximo! Well, Ali Ahmed, he stared dismissal in the face and lift to tell the tale, and he puts the next one out of the ground. Last ball coming up. Oh, hits that really well, but picks out the field. They'll get one. I don't think they've really got any chance for two. They won't even try in the end. So it'll be 107 for nine. Pack okay, they do bat out the 10, but they're looking a little bit light on against the Hornchurch side. Yeah, like a pile of rabid dogs out there in Championship Week. They want this so bad. Oh, hopefully he dodged the ball. He caught one on the knee yesterday. I wonder if he needed some medical attention. Anyway, his big barba get going to Hankins. Bit of respect there. And well, that's a, that's a the LBW the second time around. Well, I think that ball was about to go onto the stump, so it's good he got back. Yeah, and I think he does get the foot down just in time. <laughs> anyway, in the air, but this is going to fly. It's going to fly over the field. It's going to fly over the field. Maximo. The old Maximo to get Gavin going here. First one's on the board. Oh. I'm the court marshal here. Anyway, that's going to be four. As, uh, Absolutely pounded by Hankins. Now drives on the up, gets it up and over. It's Eve Potro Carreras, the first runs of Hassan Ali. Ray steps forward, steps outside off, and he goes bang. Hankins was looking for something short, I think, there. Got in a good position to pull. Gets four. This is kind of like a slow ball that swings away and he just kind of goes with it, kind of carves it away over point. That flew to the boundary. All right, Sky, now here's your chance. Daniel Dorkayet sets himself under the ball and he takes it. 
A really first mistake, and it's cashed in by Pakai Care, who needed turning point badly. They get VJ for 12. Baba strikes in his second over, and it's 29 for one. Perfect technique. One good fielder to another because VJ is pretty decent himself. Uh, with the bat, he goes for 12 in this contest. 29 for one. Anyway, this one is neither, and it's going to be up and over the leg side and out of here. Maximo Lisbon opens his account with six. Lifting Bubba up and over the leg side. Chairman of the board loves it. Young left armor. Oh. And he gets just kind of glanced away with power as Hankins gets six. Maximo! Welcome to the crease, young Muhammad Ati. What a shot. Oh. Oh. Power. That is power. And that's back to back. Maximo! Uh, oh. It's a good shot again. And he's just going to put this over cover point. Well, that's a dangerous one. Oh, Sarah oh. has warned that. Well, maybe he just skated past it. But uh, all's well that ends well. I think there's everyone up in the seats again. But Maximo bowled him round the legs, and Hankins just shows a bit too much of the furniture. Gets done through the back door as the teeth fights back after going the journey a few times. Maybe a little window of opportunity for Pack Eye Care as Hornchurch lose their opener at 53 for two. Anyway, slow ball, picked and hit. There's no one back here. One bounce four. But Irfan gets his first boundary of the contest. It's a bit of a task as Hassan Ali comes back to bowl over number six. And he's going to start with a wicket. Well, top of this stump gets knocked back as Edwards goes. Just kind of lost his rhythm a little bit in that innings. Just showed a bit of the furniture to Hassan Ali who cashes in. And Hornchurch having it all their own way at the moment at 62 for three. Yeah, brilliant bowling from the big man. They bring back Hassan Ali and he hits the top of leg stump. Shorter one. Ah, gets it wrong. Shorter, slower. Turned by Malik who seizes the moment and gets four. And Shot. now Payson just leans on it. Oh, Malik. It makes it look so easy sometimes. Oh, no. And, well, that's been a pretty popular area, hasn't it? Maximo time. Last ball to seven. Now, yeah, Mallet's got a taste for it. He wants more. He gets the strike. And at the end of seven, it's walking sticks. 77 for three. Uh-oh. That's bad. Yeah, it's going to be even worse. It's Siete Carrera. Seven up time. No ball plus six as Brutt gets it wrong. Well, it does go short. Irfan doesn't care. Swats him away. Maximo! To wait a little while for Irfan's first, but his second comes pretty quickly. Yeah, you have to say, tries to bang it in, but the 15 off two balls kills this game now. Now, edged and gone. Okay, well, you at least move the line along as thick outside edge flies through to Muhammad Isan. So Irfan goes six. Six and out here in the eighth over. And Hornchurch will lose a fourth wicket. It's 92 for four. Uh-oh. He goes short and outside the legs. And that's trouble with a capital T. As Arthur G gets off the mark. Maximo. Lifted up in the air. And that's going to fly. It'll tie the scores. Malik. Well, Corey said he was lucky to survive the LBW appeal the ball before, but he puts the next one <laughs> up and out of the ground. Maximo and the chairman of the board. Well, he's certainly getting some mileage out of that new knee. Just one run. Here's the last ball potentially of the match. And that will be it. They'll finish it with a four. Malik to 24. Again, he kind of paces in his innings nicely. Had a bit of a look around. And Hornchurch, although they don't get the octopus, they get seven points out of the possible eight. And their interesting rivalry with Pack Eye Care continues. Uh, but in this chapter, it is Hornchurch that get the points. And they win this game with eight balls to spare.